going on guys it's Ethan from West Virginia fishing and hunting and today I'm gonna teach you guys how to make an inline spinner wire shaft spinner body clevis spinner blade size 10 hook okay so the first thing you want to do is take your hook and eye of your wire shaft and put it through just like that and then put it into your fly vise. Next thing you want to do is take your spinner body and slide it through, pinching down this part right here. It's kind of hard because I'm using stainless steel wire, so bear with me real quick as I try to get this. Okay, there we go. See, just like that. Next you take your clevis and your spinner blade and you put it through just like that. And then you feed the eye of the clevis onto your wire shaft. Just like that. If you really wanted to you could add beads like this but for the sake of the video I'm not going to do that. Next you need some clamp scissors and you clamp down right and then you take your wire shaft put it over top of the wire of the scissors and take it around once and like I said I'm using stainless steel it's really hard to bend and there you go take your wire cutters there's any type of wire cutters Put it on there and there you go. There you got an inline spinner that can catch you anything from bass, crappy, bluegill, walleye, trout, anything. So I hope you guys liked the video. Please don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out everyone.